So, I am going to introduce a couple of people who have something very important to share, who along with Natural Balance are helping launch Guide Dog, National Guide Dog Month. These are the stars of the television show CSI Miami, ladies and gentlemen, Eva LaRue and Omar Miller. Would you please welcome them? Thank you very much. We have had such an amazing day. We got a chance to go on a tour of the beautiful grounds and meet some of the trainers. And I don't know if any of you saw us over there kind of gingerly taking our first steps blindfolded. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. It's been a very humbling day. And all of you guys deserve a round of applause for what it is that you're here to support and what it is that you do. When you get a chance this month and next month during National Guide Dog uh, Awareness Month, when you go to a Petco, they're doing what they call the Roundup program. So if you spend $5.60, you can tell them at the cash register, I'd like to round it up to $6. And that extra money will go into the Guide Dog Fund to fund all of these incredible projects that you see. It takes about $40,000 to train one dog and all of and everybody gets one of these dogs um, at no cost and it's helping to change a lot of people's lives so please when you go to buy food for your cat or your dog <laughs> please round it up or your pet giraffe so um we play uh crime scene investigators with a specialty in forensics on television and one thing that we hear consistently is that our work actually confuses the work of uh, real life forensic scientists because everyone expects them to solve things in an hour. <laughs> and uh, obviously real life doesn't work that way. And today we had the pleasure of meeting someone who does actually do what we portray on television. So today we have the honor of presenting the inaugural. The very first it's a Petco and Natural Balance Foods, their first National Guide Dog Month Change of Life Award. And the change of life is representative of how a dog can change your life in that partnership together. And this is the first inaugural award. And so we'd like to present it to Dr. Cecilia von Beraldingen, as someone who we've met today and spent the day with and who has humbled both of us and has become a hero in a very short period of time for us. We've met her and her family and her courage and her uh, uh, tenacity for what it is that she does and continues to do is incredible. So please, let's get a loud round of applause for Dr. Cecilia von Beraldingen to accept this award on behalf of Natural Balance Pet Foods and Petco. Good morning, everyone. Oh, good afternoon, everyone. <laughs> Oh, I just it's your award. Yeah, I just, thank you so much. Um, I've been a guide dog user for almost 20 years now. I lost my vision about 20 years ago as a result of what was um, a brain tumor. They called it a benign brain tumor, but when I awoke from neurosurgery, I found out that I had no vision whatsoever in my left eye and very little vision left in my right eye. And at that point in my career and my life, that was a very devastating um, occurrence. My family and I had just moved up to Oregon. My husband and I are both forensic scientists. We had accepted positions with the Oregon State Police Forensic Laboratory up there. I was supposed to, uh, and I did, start up the DNA section for the Oregon State Police Forensic Laboratory. Uh, I had my loss of vision six months into my new job. Our children were, um, Katie was only uh, 18 months old at the time. My son, Nick, was five months. And my life had been turned upside down. Fortunately, I got hooked up with the Oregon Commission for the Blind, and I 
learn basic living skills. Uh, they came to the lab and they looked at what my job entailed and provided me with adaptive equipment to allow me to continue in my career, which I did. And I learned mobility skills. I learned to use a cane. And I became a very proficient cane user, but I still mourned my independence. I, I just didn't feel like I could do the things that I wanted to do. And then I got Cola, my first guide dog, in December of 1994. She was a sweet, beautiful, yellow Labrador female. And two days after graduation, flew back on Saturday after graduation, and on Monday morning, I walked very proudly into a courtroom in Oregon to testify in a very high profile murder case that was going on in Oregon at the time. And Cola, changed my life. I mean, I regained my independence, um, my confidence was renewed, and I was able to travel all over the United States to do my job. Cole and I traveled to 32 states together in Cancun, Mexico. <laughs> uh, and uh, when Cola, Cola worked for almost nine years and she retired in 2003, and I came back to guide dogs, and I got Neoki, who is taking a nap behind me here <laughs> at the podium. But uh, Neoki and Cola, I, I really can't thank guide dogs for the blind enough because basically, if I didn't have these two guides in my life, I would not have been able to continue in my career and to do the things that I do. So thank you to Guide Dogs, thank you to Natural Balance, thank you Omar, Omar and, and Eva for being part of this campaign um, and observing National Guide Dogs Month. Thank you.